you two have to get along or you are not going in to my pen case. Hello and welcome to Writer Always Write. Look at these two lovely beauties. Lavender is my favorite color and since this e these two are in the lavender family, I snapped them up. This is the Sailor Compass 1911 fountain pen with the purple resin body. It came in a lovely simple package. Let's see if I can get it off here. Uh, this is the Sailor Converter that came with it, and they have a black and a blue ink cartridge. Sailor is a proprietary company, so if you do get a Sailor, you will have to use their converters. You also have to use their cartridges. Sit that over there. The This is a clear, it looks like it's a see straight through, so it is a demonstrator. It has the silver body on it. Let's see, here we go. The feed is a clear feed, and the color of the ink is the color that your feed will be. That's really, really cute. Like I said, it has the silver trim. This is a medium fine, so I believe that it's probably an extra fine or a fine in Western terms. It has, I don't know if you can see that, but it has a simple little anchor on it, which I believe that most sailors do. There's no fanfare in reference to the, the nib on this. And this is a screw cap. Let's see, taking off the end. There's a couple of screws that you have to do. Here's the feet. And the converter comes in the color of the pen. Another neat little attachment with the pen. And there we go. We're going to screw that back on and we're going to set this to the side. This is the Diplomat Trap. This pen is also postable. Very postable and it's definitely not coming off. When you post it, it doesn't feel... Let me go back to this. That feels really, that's a good length in your hand. And then when you post it, it doesn't feel too long. So I like that. Okay, now we're gonna set this here. This is the Diplomat Traveler Fountain Pen. It's an elegant, slim design, of course with Diplomat. And of course the finial has the little design on it. And uh, if you've seen my other videos, I, I'm a sucker for finials and I'm also a sucker for nibs. Look at that nib. If you can see that, it has the a nice little decoration on it. And um, it's not the fanciest, but I really like that. This one is a fine, and this is basically a snap cap. The, look at that, the clip on it is nice and sturdy. It says that this pen is postable, but if, as you can see, it's, it's, it's not really going to stay on there. So, like I said, I don't post my pens. So, eh, that's fine. I really, I'm not bothered with that. I love that satisfying click that it makes. Diplomat did come in a simple little box, a metal box, actually. It has a false bottom under it. And here is the cartridge. Diplomat is not a proprietary company, so you can use whatever kind of cartridge you want or the converter that you want. I'll close that up and we're gonna put that and move that out of the way. Both pins are about the same. Well, the Diplomat is just a bit higher, but both pins are about the same height. This one weighs, of course, with it being a metal body with a purple lacquer on it. This one does weigh a little more and they both feel really good in the hand.
it's not too short and since like i said i don't post my pins since i really don't think this is postable even though they say that it's postable it, it won't stay on there i got both of these pins from goulet pen Dot com as always when they send their pins they send you send with it a lovely lollipop and a lovely little sticker that goes on it and I think I'm gonna take this sticker off here and let's see I don't have my little take this sticker off and we're gonna stick this baby right here right here for our writing sample and we'll get that done when we come back. Okay, before we start the writing sample, we'll be using the Tanibra Papuratum. I got this from Franklin Kristoff. I believe it means dark purple. And we'll open it and get an idea of what the color may look like. Here we go. Whoa, that's dark. And we'll spread just a touch over here just to get an idea of how that looks. Set that over there. Here we go. Okay. A little feedback. Nice and smooth though. And it's writing. Okay. Okay. This is regular paper, uh, just some, just a little notebook, and I'm not going to even try to, you know, well, there's, there's no shading. It, um, I mean, no, the wetness to it. I mean, you can write backwards. It feels, it feels okay, actually. Okay. And let's see, fast writing. No. Okay. Barely touching. It feels pretty smooth. There we go. All right. Let's try the Diplomat Traveler Pen here. We'll sit this baby right here. You can definitely tell that the it's a little thicker in the lines and heavier on the paper than the Sailor Compass. Both pens haven't been used in about four or five days. Both pens wrote right out of the, as soon as I inked them, no hard stars. They wrote immediately. It does sound good. I mean, you can hear the feedback, but it still feels smooth. I'm sure it's the same result probably. Yeah, just a little bit of, it is laying just a touch more ink. Let's see. Not that much in reference to writing backwards. Speed writing, it does keep up. It also feels barely touching it and it writes. Thank you for watching, Writer Always Write. I hope you like, subscribe, comment, and join me again on my next video.